awesome. Anything else you'd like to add? Um, no, I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> Thank you. What I'm inviting people into an experience of with nature yoga is embodiment, which is not about the pose. It's about your personal experience and your personal connection with the planet. I love just opening up new pathways of discovery and finding myself forming to the rocks and to the trees and just really taking the basics of yoga and then expanding on those alignment principles and opening up into something even more playful. When we are able to approach life from a perspective of playfulness, we can see so much more, we can create so much more. Play is at the source of vitality, play is at the source of productivity and creativity. You can do poses that you can never even imagine doing on just a mat. And it just, it like really opens up on possibilities. I love it. <laughs> I have a friend who doesn't like yoga, traditional yoga. So we were saying, this will be perfect for her. It's challenging, it's hiking, and uh, she's gonna start doing yoga with me. This is a really awesome experience. I like to hike and climb um, all the time, but I kind of separate that from yoga. I've never really thought to combine it together. I've had some injuries as well, so it's nice not to have to be on a completely horizontal flat surface. Yeah, every time I was like, oh, I should be doing something, and I was on a rock or I was looking around, I was like, I just kept feeling like, I don't have to try so hard, I can just really be in the moment. So, I love that. Stay really mindful and connected as you flow between poses. Your body is actually showing you how it wants to open. But let's just remember the essence and know that no matter what our level is or how we're feeling that day, this is always there for us. And this is how we can empower ourselves to, to be at our optimal.